there. Nope, shots fired, shots fired. Hit them. They're gonna go off into the ditch and they just did. Nope, they're continuing North Marina Drive. I'm gonna try to stop them here. Oh, and we have a bad handling line dead. She's down, she's down. Whole bunch of them, whole bunch of them. Somebody said you just put a barrier, you dumbass. You gotta be kidding me, dude. He's down, he's down. Holy crap, that escalated fast. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 5. My name is Jeff Aviano, and this is LSPDFR. We are going to do a patrol in the Rancho area. We're going to stay in Rancho Davis, kind of downtown, uh, using the new 2016 Ford Explorer, the uh, 2016 FPIU. And uh, it's raining, so it's going to be a rainy night. We've got our rain jacket on, and we're ready to go fight some crime. How about it? So... Let's get started. We'll just pull out here and I think we'll head to the left. We'll head towards Rancho instead of Davis and uh, we'll see what we can get into. How about that? Attention unit two, Lincoln 12. Citizens All right. report. I drive under the influence. Reports of a uh, possible 1055 up this way. We're going to go ahead and just uh, head over this way so we make contact with that vehicle. Since we are right here, um, we can get on the highway and see if uh, we can stop that vehicle. Since it is a uh, DUI case, um, I will be going out of my jurisdiction a little bit of the beat today because we don't want uh, somebody, you know, like this right here all over the road. All over the road, and we can't, s can't let them get away with that. Oh, wow, dude. That is a bad one. We're going to light them up right up here on the right under the tunnel. And they are stopping. Oh, cool. If we can get them stopped underneath here, that would be amazing because we wouldn't have to worry about... Oh, hello. That shouldn't be a uh, pursuit. There should be something else going on over there. All right, so we're going to be out with these people. Let's see what this is all about. Spotlight on them. This astrotope. See if they've been drinking and driving. We'll run their plate. 46 Edward Edward King 572. Well, that, that would be the one. That would be the one. All right. Target license Waiting for the 1028. Four. Six, Edward, Edward, King, five, Matt seven, Smith. two, no 1099. No 1099. Okay, let's let's talk to Matt Smith, see if he's been drinking. Hello, sir. How you doing this evening? I'm pulling you over because you were you had failure you had failed to maintain lanes back there. Wait a minute, dude. Uh and uh that's why I'm pulling you over. You also been called in, so have you had anything to drink or anything like that? Yara wants some too? No, I don't, but I need your identification, proof of insurance, all that good stuff. I appreciate you being honest with me, okay? All right, cool, Matt. Just sit tight. I'll be right back with you, okay? All right, so we'll run his information. We'll see if uh, everything checks out. We will, we will. I know the spotlight isn't turned on. If you turn it on, look how bright it gets in here. It's like ridiculous, so that's why I don't use that. Uh, if you were wondering, pen database, Matt Smith. Let's see. I knew a Matt Smith in high school. A very common name. Valid. Uh, no warrants. Everything looks good there. Let's check the vehicle. Um, see if it had insurance. I'm pretty sure it was valid, yeah. Expired registration on it, though. That's not good. But that's probably the least of his worries here. We are going to get him out of the... We are going to uh, administer a breathalyzer on him here. All right, Matt. Need you to blow into the tube. Let's see if... Uh, if you are being honest with me, if you are, I'm going to let you slide with the registration. But if you if you blow, then, well, you're going to be in trouble. And you're in trouble. All right, you just step out of the vehicle for me. All righty. Come over here. I know you're, you've been drinking. I want to make sure we do this okay so you don't get hurt. All right. I'm going to go ahead and place him in cuffs for our safety. Police! Stop before I before we uh, pat him down just because I don't want him running off into traffic here. All right, Matt. Nope, nope, nope. Come here. All right. Anything illegal on you? Hey. Really? They Here's always want to get four. killed, Nobody I swear. They always want to get killed. Matt Smith. We got a court case for you. All right. Nothing in the interest. All right. You just come over here. Nope. You are dumb. You're trying to get hit by a car, aren't you? Well, you are drinking, so not the smartest decisions I've ever heard of. Let's get PT down here to pick him up. Needed. His vehicle will be, un will be impounded. In we'll search it. We'll twerk that, while we do it. Roger. Copy it, dispatch. We'll just uh, auto ins insta spawn in. All right, what do we got here? 
Anything, anything. You know, you can't get over on that side. Hello, nice parking job back there, lady. My lord. All right, nothing of interest, nothing in a uh, pack of redwood cigarettes. All right, so the vehicle's going to be impounded since he decided to be drinking and driving tonight. Uh huh. Well, hopefully, uh, the vehicle lines should be fixed now. I did change the handling lines, they should be good to go. We'll see how that all pans out. I don't know what the hell they're, these two are doing, but I guess you can't get in right there. So we're going to move up in front of here. That tow truck is trying to figure life out as well. So we'll wait for them. Uh, they're going to go the other way. Yeah, they're going to the other way. If the tow truck uh, messes up, then we'll just continue back to uh, Rancho and we'll be code four on this one and we'll be 10-8. Unit 2, Lincoln 12. We okay. have a traffic alert for the carjacking. La Mesa, we have a carjacking La Mesa. Actually, I'm actually going to take this road and try to cut back across over to them. See if we can catch up with them. They're down below. I'm not sure if they're in the river. Kind of looks like they might be on the highway. And if they're on the highway, they might be coming towards us if they take that exit. We'll wait and see what happens here. We're waiting at the light, and they're, okay, they're going to take the highway, so we're going to go ahead and light up. We're going to be responding uh, to a carjacking, code three. Normally, I wouldn't take this call, but uh, like I said, you know, dangerous people. And it was kind of quiet. I was driving around in Rancho. Nothing was really going on, so even more reasons for us to try to catch up to these guys and, and subdue them. Let them know that you can't be uh, carjacking people on our watch. It's not going to be tolerated. All right, we'll take uh, the two here. I think they're taking the two westbound, it looks like. All righty. Watch these cars, you know, and the, the rain. It's really easy to get, you know, behind the car whenever it's raining and make a mistake. Here's the interior of this, if you're wondering. It's nothing too, too special, but hey, it is still an interior nonetheless. Let's try to catch up to this guy. Move traffic. It's kind of... If I get in the left lane, I might be able to catch up to him. Let's see. I mean, carjacking is not cool, man. Not on our watch. We are maxed out, and they are still... Still moving it. We are slowly catching them, though. Try to move everybody out of the way. Kind of working there. They are scooting pretty good. Whoa, that was scary. All right, who is it? This one right here, Felter. Yeah, it is. All right, yeah, they they see us, but they don't seem to be care carrying too much carjacking victim. Okay, dude, I'm gonna give them one shot here. See if they'll stop up here. It's going to be a felony stop on this vehicle. That's for damn sure. Get them off their side of the road. All right, right there. Right there's going to be it. Go ahead and pull up right here like this. Call for a backup unit. Yep, that's the vehicle. We'll turn our uh, takedowns on in here. Waiting for this unit to get on scene. Oh, no, you don't. 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 Uh, yeah, we'll do stun gun. They got a weapon. They have a gun. No, put it down. Put it down. Put it down. Get the damn gun out, you idiot. Jeez, man. Shots fired. Shots fired. Attention. This is dispatch. We are code four. No pulled a gun on us so required. fast. So fast she pulled a gun on us. All right, let's slow traffic down so we don't get killed here. Wow. We may be able to put some cones down here. Uh, place large stripe one. Yep, that'll do. Put one right here, one right here. Oh, stop it, people. We're trying to deal with this. No, nope, put that away. Put it away. Put it away. There we go. And we'll put a uh, thing here. Yeah, we have a crime scene here, people. Just wait a minute, okay? She's obviously going to be dead. We're going to call the corner so we can get this highway opened up again. Money. She uh, 
took off. You know, she carjacked somebody. We pulled her over, try to get a uh, felony stop on her, and she just pulls a weapon on us. Like, that was not cool at all, man. That was insane, actually. It was insane, people. Matt Smith's court case was heard. All right, we'll wait for the corner. Here they are right now. Uh, they're going to be a little late to the party. That's all right. We'll wait it out a little bit here. All right, corner is on scene trying to clean this up. All right, they're good to go. We're just going to go ahead and uh, search her vehicle. Try to find out why she... Uh, maybe she had a weapon in here or something we need to recover before we send it over to the uh, towing agency. Double check that one. Should be able to remove all the cones, actually. Let's uh, remove all signs. There we go. Still learning a little bit how to use that road management by Albo. It's pretty awesome. I do like it. Nothing of interest. Okay, let's get this thing towed out of here and we'll call it a day as we clip through the car. Tow truck for you. That was nuts. With that new Euphoria physics, though, it's nice. When you shoot them once, it really throws them off guard like they actually got hit by a, you know, a bullet instead of just being Superman. So that was awesome. Other, other than, you know, she had to lose her life. That's not awesome, but what are you going to do? We'll be code 4 and 10-8. Unit 2, Lincoln 12. We've okay. got a 1099. 1099. Uh, Alvaro All right, we'll make a left turn here. We're going to be uh, code 2 over to a Copy prisoner that. transport right call. Now. Roger. Been a pretty slow night after that whole that whole shooting so far, so we're just going to be uh, heading over here to help out an officer that needs a prisoner transport. We don't ever have something like that, so I figured that'd be pretty cool to take that. We're not in a big hurry to get there. We're just kind of go two and all the way over there. All right, and up here as well. They moved. I appreciate that. As always. And we got to get on the highway, it looks like. Nope, not the highway completely, per se, but just over here where uh, the traffic stop is. You can see the lights. There it is right there. All right. Park up behind the vehicles and make contact with the officer. All right, we're going to be on scene. Two of the 12 will be on scene with them. There they are in the back anyway, so that's cool. Let's make contact with the officer. We'll take this guy over. We're on the other side of it this time. What's going on? That was quick. What a response time. Thanks. We were code two. Uh, the vehicle I've stopped just ran a red light. Okay. Uh, the driver had an outstanding felony warrant. Take them in for me, will you? Yep, we'll do it. All right, come on with me. Have a seat for me in here. Well, I think he'll get in this way. He should. I assume he's going to take care of the towing and all that good stuff. That's pretty cool. We're just going to be the transport unit in this one. Not extremely exciting, but uh, hey, what are you going to do? Are you going to get in or what are you going to do? Yep, he finally got in. All right, we'll take him. Uh, we'll take him to the nearest jail. Press zero to calculate that route, and we will. We're going to be code one. Uh, and we'll be 10-7 with one to the station. You got to take care of your warrants, bud. You can't just, uh, you can't just be out driving around with warrants like that, run red lights. It's always a small little traffic stop that gets you. That's for damn sure, so. Hopefully you won't be in here too long. They're just going to process you and all that good stuff, and you'll be out of here before you know it. It just uh, serves as a uh, way to try to get you motivated to take care of your issues like that. So that's what that's all about. All right, Mark, on in here. I swear that Apologize, dumbass. Oh, man, what are they doing? They're arguing over there. All right. I don't know if he searched you or not. We're just going to double check you before we put you in the cell here real fast. So just hang on a second for me. Didn't mean to hit you. Didn't mean to run into you there. Yeah, I know. You've had a bad night. I know. Here, let me try this again. There we go. We're going to search you before we put you in the cell. Uh, a get out of for jail free card. <laughs> Not going to help you today. A drone phone, a digital camera, butterfly knife, and used needles. Okay, so we're going to confiscate the used needles and the butterfly knife that the officer, the arresting officer, did not get. Come on in here. 
Come on in here. All right, we got a placement here ourselves. I love that we have the option to do that now with Shift T. So we're gonna put them in here ourselves since you. All right, so you're in there. All right, we're going to go do a Control O on you. Make sure you you weren't on any drugs or anything. I do that back here like we would do a blood test. So he was positive for cocaine, negative for cannabis. Well, Mark, I hope you figure it out, man. I'm sorry that, uh, you know, these things happen. Hopefully you'll learn to, uh, you know, take care of your warrants and uh, also hopefully get off cocaine. That's not a good one. So we're going to be uh, done here at the jailhouse and we'll get back out on the road. Unit 2, Lincoln 12. We yep. have a traffic alert okay. in uh, La Mesa, La Mesa. For possession of drugs for sale. We're going to go ahead and flip around here real fast and try to catch up to that vehicle that uh, might be uh, trying to transport some narcotics. We'll be code 2 that way, and then we'll reduce to code 1 once we get a little closer here. Looks like they might be heading down towards uh, where the river is, so that's kind of not going to be good. I don't like that a lot of uh, a lot of callouts seem to spawn in this LS River. It's kind of a pain in the ass, to be honest. And a lot of times when they do, do that, I kind of just give up. I'm like, oh, I'm not worried about it. Let's see if we make contact with that vehicle down here. But they are trying to do some non-legit things. They are stuck in the water down there. Yep. All right. Well, that's going to be easy enough. Hope we can get down there in time. Let's turn our lights on and. Try to put an end to this. I will try to, uh, I mean, that's pretty stupid of them. <laughs> that's stuck in the water. I mean, come on. Head this way. A little way right in here. We should be able to get in here this way. All right, cool. Let's see if we can make contact with these people down here. You never know. I mean, the drug runner call. Uh, you get these guys that uh, are heavily armed, so we're going to be careful on this stop. It's going to be in the actual river. All right. We're going to turn our takedowns on here so we can see a little bit better. And they are in their vehicle Attention out there. Attention unit 2, Lincoln 12. Approach with caution. Okay, I have them lit up here. We're going to go ahead and step out of the vehicle here. And I'm going to try to make contact with them. We need uh let's get a, two additional code Attention threes down here first in all right going in the river oh that was scary all right dude it's all over well he's swimming he's swimming where'd you go hey what are you doing you gonna drown yourself dude? hey all right, we'll wait till he gets all out of the river before we put him in cuffs here hey no 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 stop running stop running stop running lspd all right, we're, we're after this dude. He's going eastbound near Innocence Boulevard now. Just on the west side of that building in Cypress Flats. We're still after him here. He just fell. He just fell. Hey, on the ground. On the ground. All the way on the ground. Whoa, I just fell too. But he's, he definitely fell. All the way on the ground, dude. Idiot. Hey, I meant it when I said it. Don't make me shoot you. All the way to the ground. Two in the 12. I got one at gunpoint. He's uh, giving up right now. All right, going in for the arrest on him now. Two thing at 12, I got that subject, 1015. Hyren uh, Tavares. Hyren Tavares. Did you see any? No, I didn't. So we're just gonna go directly to court apparently. I, I hate that that N, when I hit no on that, it nothing you can do. If he dropped it at the car, then there's nothing we can do. Dangerous driving and resisting arrest. I mean, he was dangerous driving. He was driving in the river. Oh, man. Jailed for one year as a result. Yeah, one piece of evidence. I could. I was going to go back. I was going to hit yes and then just go look around the car, but that N key always gets me. I do want to mention that it is the 200th episode of LSPDFR, which is absolutely crazy. I know a lot of people wanted me to do like an hour episode and all that kind of stuff, but... Uh, to be honest, I just, I, I, the 200th is just, I mean, it's awesome. It's amazing that it got this far. Um, you just really, it's very difficult to get an hour out of LSPDFR. It really is. Uh, lately with this new build, it's just been a kind of a pain in the butt. So 
we're gonna do a little longer patrol just you know in just the fact that uh it is the 200th episode and I'm, i want to thank everyone for the support with the uh, lspdfr and just how much you love the series it uh, it comes and goes in waves uh after 200 episodes you have to realize you know you're no longer gonna hit you're not gonna hit a home run every single time you play the game or you know it's not gonna be the most exciting thing every single time um, but, you know, even after 200 episodes, it's been pretty awesome. It really has. Uh, and I want to thank all of you so much for all of that. Pretty cool milestone to hit the 200th episode. Um, I didn't, I forgot to say that in the beginning, but I was going to and saw my post-it note. So I was like, hey, I'll let you know that it's the 200th episode. I'm sure you already knew that or you're already shouting at the screen anyway. So no harm, no foul. We're going to make a left down here in uh, this part of Rancho and just, you know, check for gang activity and whatnot. Calling unit What's two, a hot pursuit we of a tractor? A Alrighty. Davis. Yeah, two link at twelve. We're gonna be heading over that way, We're right here in the area. Person taken off in a tractor on McDonald Street, eleven miles per hour. They're not gonna get very far. I can see it already. Yeah, it's going pretty slow. I'm not gonna lie. Pretty slow. Pretty pretty slow. All right, dude. Thank you. I'll take over primary on that. I'm sure they're like, what the hell is a tractor doing in this area, especially in Strawberry? All right, yeah, we got eyes on the guy now. It's like a white male. It's occupied times one. He seems to be not listening to us. Driver of the tractor, pull it over and turn the engine off. He's not listening. Might have to go a little bit more desperate measures. Probably use a spike strip on this vehicle. So let's try to get a couple more Attention units. units. And we're going to try to take over as the uh, takedown vehicle here. Although that was pretty ballsy there, buddy. Copy that. All right, they're with him now. Oh, lady. Okay, it's still coming down this way. I don't think we're going to be able to stop it in time. We have to see which way it's going to go. And it's continuing this way. All right. Whoa. Okay. He's going to go this way. Let's try to put some spikes down on this guy. Right here might be the spot to do it. Let's do it. Nope. Not enough time. Not enough time. Pull it. Pull it. Pull it. We'll try it again. Try to get back up here on him again. Watching out for these guys. Hopefully he stays going straight. We're about to find out if that's going to happen. I'm not really sure if it is or not. Nope. He's going the other way, of course. I mean, this is all we can really do in this kind of situation is uh, without getting too overly aggressive. I'm going to cut back through the vanilla unicorn. There he is right there. He's headed into Pillbox Hill. Kill my siren. We might be able to get him right up here at this intersection. Nope. Nope. He saw us. He knows what we're up to. He does. I swear he knows what we're up to. All right. These units are being really safe in the rain. That's actually pretty refreshing to see. All right. Let's get through here. Oh, man. He just picks up just enough speed to be annoying. Let's try. Let's hope he doesn't turn up here. Let's hope he does not turn up here. Let's try this gonna be enough or no we'll have to try some bigger spikes and come on come this way dude they seem like they have him stopped over there we might be able to take him down he's a sneaky little bastard all right this is gonna have to be it right up here if he gets through there we'll spike him but I think we might have him stopped yeah he's pinned up against this Watch, watching the crossfire, guys. Going around this way. Oh, nope, he's running this way. He's giving up. On the ground, dude. They got him, they got him. I was trying to do it kind of legitly, but it didn't work out, so. He's under arrest. We got that tractor stopped. Good lord, that was ridiculous. Nothing like tractor problems and in downtown outrageous all right we're code four on that nice nicely done guys nicely done 
All right, well, that's going to do it for this episode. I had a lot of fun driving out here in the rain. It was a little uh, docile, and then we had some crazy parts of the uh, of the day, especially with that shootout with that lady in the beginning uh, of the shift, but that was cool taking that uh, transport call. I know a lot of you guys probably would have, would have liked to have seen that, so I decided to keep that in there. So with that said, I will see you in the next one. Take care. Thanks again for 200 episodes, guys. Amazing.